Hey everyone, glad to have you join me in uh, for Tuesday with Pastor Dan. Uh, back from our trip, but we were back last week, but it was super late and it just kind of got lost in the muddle. So here we are kicking back off. Um, so Tuesday with Pastor Dan, glad to have you join in. Um, I had someone today telling me uh, that they are they 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 have been conscious long enough about this that they do it now regularly. Is that when they think of someone, they immediately send them a message, whether it's via phone or email or text or whatever it is. But they just think about them and they're like, "Oh, I'm gonna reach out to that person." And they do instead of like with me, who I am terrible about. It, I'm like, "Think, I need to reach out to that person," and then I don't. Like I go, my mind just goes on to the next thing, and I kind of lose it. But it it made me think of like the level of connectivity and how we are we're bonded together and then it made me think about Barrett has this book called All the World and maybe you some of you have read it you can see it i believe there's someone reading it on youtube i'm sure if you type in all the world children's book it's a little board book if you want to go get it it's also fantastic it's uh, i don't know if it's one of his favorite but it's one of my favorites to read him and uh i'm not going to read you the whole thing but i'm going to read just a smidge out of like the end the last few pages and he goes, Nana's, Papa's, Cousin's, Ken, Piano, Harp, Violin, Baby's Pass from Neck to Knee, All the World is You and Me, Everything You See, Smell, Everything You Hear, Smell, See, All the World is Everything, and Everything is You and Me. Hope and Peace and Love and Trust, All the World is All of Us. And that's where it ends, All the World is All of Us. And it's, I love it. I love it. Um, as you can see, I have it fairly well memorized. <laughs> Um, but all the world is all of us and, and the collectiveness of it and how if we were to simply reach out more as we were to connect more, we truly believe all the world is all of us. This, this connectivity, the world is this beautiful grand place, but we live in it. We are, it's just like the church is not the building. The church is the people that come into the building. The presbytery, if you will, is not all of the churches. It's all of the people that make up the churches along with their pastors. That's that's it. The world, is, yes, it is this beautiful spinning orb hurtling through space, but it's about what's happening on it. And it's about us and this connectivity and how I know that I can do a better job. But if all the world with the hope and the peace and the love and the trust could be better, if we, we did that thing, the person was talking to me about the, that if we think about a person, maybe do more than just think about them, but speak to them, reach out to them. Jesus talks about it all the time in scripture. It's about the connectivity we have with one another. It's about these bonds. It's about the, the papas, the nanas, the cousins, the kins, and the friends. Um, and it's become so much easier. We don't have excuses. I can get a hold of my grandmother in a moment's notice who lives in Wyoming. Bethany can get a hold of her mom who lives in in Maryland. I can get a hold of my best friends who live in Denver and Virginia. Not hard. Our excuses for not holding on to this love and peace and hope and trust that is what binds us together and what we can spread are really wearing thin. But we first we have to recognize what the board book says, is that all the world is all of us. And we're connected and linked together, bound together, um, not just through our commonalities, but our differences and the fact that we are human in this place and this time. I love it. I, I think it's a powerful thing to let settle in, and I'm excited to be teaching my son about it and letting him experience that and learn that and grow into that. So I hope that as we work towards a more connected and tight-knit world, that we take the moments and the times to recognize that it's all of us and that we can connect closer and more further each and every day. May you all be blessed.